everyone, it's Jess. Today I'm going to show you a fun technique on how to simply add texture to our blanks. So I'm using our natural brass east blank and there are these fun little shapes, kind of like a directional, really cool shape. This is in our global collection and um, easily added texture using a ball peen hammer. So once you add texture and relief it with a reliefing block, you get this really Cool pattern they're all a little bit different and then you have like that two-tone brass look too which is really beautiful and then you can easily connect pieces because there's a hole drilled on the top here um, I'm just gonna quickly show you how easy this is and you could use either our four ounce ball peen hammer or eight um, today I have our eight ounce handy and I'm gonna go ahead and add some texture with that so um, I have our rubber dampening block and then our steel bench block on top and that helps a little bit with dampening like the loud noise when you hit and um, just striking it's just not as um, hard as an impact if you're just on a hard surface. So go ahead with the round end of the hammer and start tapping to add texture um, around the edges and to the center. And then with our um, reliefing block, you could use the white side or the dark gray sides to start sanding and removing um, some of that finish from the raised areas. And then you're gonna get, um, your impressions will remain a little bit darker. And our natural brass finish is, um, some pieces vary, you know, between like a, um, medium to darker finish. So depending on the piece, the colors may just range a little bit, but that's the beauty and the, the natural metal that we have here. And you get that pretty luster from the highlighted brass when you do this. Okay, so now I have three of these blanks with beautiful hammered texture to them and this piece here is our Rhapsody um, medallion, and I simply added chain, and this bead on an eye pin um, to make it look like it's suspending in the center, and added holes, their hole punch plier to the bottom, and then simply just created bead links with some of the Swarovski crystals and Asian cut crystals, and our spacer here. These little textured pieces are just suspending from the bottom. And you can see that the center one hangs just a little bit lower than the other two. But a super fun technique. You could do it with a variety of our different blanks and the different finishes we have. Like I said, natural brass. We have solid brass, artisan copper, solid pewter. But um, have fun exploring textures and adding some dimension to your designs.